is Eric Ferris from Motherboards.org. Today we'll be doing an upgrade on the new 2009 13-inch MacBook Pro. What we'll be doing is we'll be changing out the standard hard drive and memory with a new SSD drive and 4 gigabytes of the new DDR3 memory. Our sponsors for this event are both Kingston and Crucial. Follow along and see what improvements can be gained by doing this small performance upgrade. After removing the 10 screws in the back plate, we begin this procedure by removing the old RAM. The memory that we're installing in this new MacBook Pro is 4 GB of the new crucial DDR3 8500 1066MHz memory. When installing the memory, you will know that there is a groove inside the memory chip. Please make sure the groove in the memory chip matches up with the slot into which it's being installed. Before installing the new Kingston SSD drive, we must first remove the old HD drive from the MacBook Pro. After removing the screws and the hard drive brace, all you must simply do is remove the SATA cable before moving on to the next procedure. To begin installation of the new Kingston SSD drive into the MacBook Pro, all you must first do is connect the SATA cable and then do the steps in reverse to reinstall the new SSD drive into the system. That's it for the installation. Now let's move on to some test results. All I can say is wow after viewing these test results. As you can see, there is a vast improvement in performance from such a very small and simple upgrade.